We're only two days into the jury selection process. The judge has requested that an entire week be blocked off for that. Even if this does get completed by the end of this week, the judge will not begin opening statements and call the first witness until next Monday. But much more work needs to be done before the jury is selected. Today, the second group of over 100 jurors reported for jury duty and were questioned by the attorneys and judge. Both sides want to ensure the jury picked are healthy, can get paid from their jobs while here, and don't have any personal conflicts for the next month that could take their focus off of the case. Many jurors were dismissed today for a whole host of reasons. Uh, this case involves um, the death of uh, Sierra Jogwin. Does anyone uh, have a had? Did anyone have a personal relationship or personal knowledge of Sierra Jogwin? The current jury pool is still well over 100, which means attorneys have a nice group to continue to question in order to select the right people to be seated for this case. Tomorrow, the jurors that have not been dismissed will report for duty once again. They're going to be questioned individually. The attorneys as well as the judge will find more out about these jurors' backgrounds and their beliefs that will hopefully help them seat the jury that is perfect for this case. Reporting from the Fulton County Courthouse, Michelle Zapata, WTOL 11.